What's up, guys? It's me, your badass here, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Brown walkthrough. Okay, so we finally made it to what town is this again? It's been a while. Oh, let me see. Let me see. See, this is what you gotta always prepare. Oh, Igaloo. Yeah, Igaloo City, and it looks like we have quite a few things to actually accomplish around here. I do believe that there is a Safari Zone right here, so I think that's what we're gonna do first. Go into the Safari Zone, see what's up. And, uh, well, it's not the Safari Zone, but it's a park. And you pretty much get to pay, yeah, you get to pay 500 Poke Dollars, and then after that, just go inside to the, to, to, to do something. Now, I don't know exactly what you're going to find here, so I'm just going to try and capture some Pokemon. And as you can see, we have found an Execute first, so I'm just going to throw a Pokeball right here, just for the sheer fun of it. And, uh, well, as you can see... Execute doesn't want to be my Pokemon right now. And Fudge. Okay, we're gonna keep on throwing Pokeballs until this guy just becomes mine. Two, three. Welcome back, Executmon right here. Okay. Executmon is back on the team, I think. Not back on the team, but you know what I mean. So here we have Execute, the egg Pokemon. Often mistaken for eggs. When disturbed, they quickly gather and attack in swarms. And, well, let's go right ahead and just call him its good old uh, nickname. So, let's see. Eggs. Zekumon. If you guys don't remember, call this Pokemon Executumon back in Pokemon Leaf Green after I had my little frustrations with uh, Patrick. It actually, it actually worked out for, you know, it worked out for my team and all that stuff. And, well, here's Rhyhorn. And, well, let's see. Still doesn't want to go away. I think the catching rate's a little easier, I don't know. And, well, it ran away, so that's no biggie right there now. I kind of feel like I'm going to lose out on Pokeballs before I run out of steps right here now. Yeah, I don't know exactly what to find right here, so let's go ahead and just keep on throwing Pokeballs. I know I got snacks and rocks and whatnot. And, well, there it is. Okay, so let's move on. I forgot that we can actually run. Totally forgot. Now... There we have a Magmar, and we already caught one of these. We actually got this guy in a, in a trade, so we don't really need it. It's actually our strongest Pokemon right now, and... Oh, it looks like we have to Surf right here. Okay, so let's go ahead and uh, Surf our Pokemon. Look at that. That's a first. And we're going to be finding some items. Some great items right here, and we're going to be finding another Magmar. So, anywho, guys, how have you been? How has everything been for every single one of you guys out there in YouTube land? I've been great. I've been awesome, and as many of you guys already know, I am focusing all my attention now on the hack games, mainly because I kind of want to, you know, I kind of want to, uh, well, I need to restock on Pokemon uh, Moon games and all that stuff, or, you know, footage for Pokemon Moon, but I did say that I was going to do a, uh, what was it called, uh, a Summer of Hacks, and I only came out with only two hack games, so... I, yeah, you know, we're just going to run away from here. Now, I did promise a summer of hacks and all that stuff. So, what will happen is that, you know, I'm just going to keep on doing hacks until I stock up on plenty of Pokemon Moon walkthrough episodes. And, wow, just my luck, I am, uh, yeah, I, I need to get rid of uh, something right here. And, well, let's see. What does this TM15 do? Hyper Beam. Okay, so... Pretty, uh, pretty obvious right there. So let's get, let's see. Now, I could, I'm just gonna get rid of a few items right here that I don't need right now. I'm pretty sure I can buy some, some better items now that you know, we're what seven, seven uh, badges in. So, okay, so we're good enough for two. And here we have another trade stone, which is, of course, many of you guys already know. You use the trade stone on a Pokemon that can evolve exclusively through trade, and bam, you get yourself the fully evolved form. How do you think I got Ultra Cycle right there? And this Bell Sprout is. Yeah, it doesn't want to be my Pokemon, too. Come on. God dang it. And, well, run away. Okay. So, yeah, guys, more focus on the hack games right now. And we will be back with Pokemon Moon in no time. It's just, you know, good old Draven needs to stop slacking for just a little bit. And, well, let's see. Let's go ahead and here. And, let's see. How many did you catch? I'm bush from all the work. Let's see. I caught a Chansey. That makes me make this a worthwhile. Whew, I'm tired of all this fun. Okay. 
Now, I've only caught, what, one Pokemon right now, and I'm pretty sure I'm wasting a lot of my steps on some on, 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 on things that I should be doing. And here we have another Chansey, so let's go right ahead and see if we can capture this Pokemon. And, well, look at that. This is not... Yeah, this is not going to be easy right now, so let's just go ahead and keep on grabbing items. And here we have the TM48. And, well, let's go ahead and take a look at what this is all about. Rock Slide. Okay, so that's a very good move. So now, I should probably get rid of another item right here. You know what? Rare Candy. I am going to give you to somebody here. Uh, let's go ahead and give it to Master. Okay, so that's that. And, well, now we have a spot for one more item right here. And, well, we're going to be attacked by another Chansey right here. Whew. Okay, now... Well, okay, so the question is, what led into my decision on just postponing the whole Pokemon Moon thing? Uh, one of them being that... Oh, look at that. It's a Growlithe. <laughs> uh, one of them being that, you know, my my schedule has picked up immensely again. And it, you know, it just... As you guys already know, when my schedule picks up, it's just, it's just hectic. And look at that. We caught ourselves Growlithe. And, well, it's going to be added to the Pokedex, as you can see. Growlithe, the the puppy Pokemon, a very protective of its territory. It will bark and bite and repel intruders from the space. So, let's go right ahead and nickname this bo this guy Budkiss, because, well, we're getting back... Well, we're getting the crew back together again, so here we go. Budkiss, alrighty. So, Budkiss has been uh, transferred. Okay, so... Give me a second, guys. I gotta do something real quick. I'll be right back. Alrighty, I'm back. Just had to do a little bit of laundry right here. You know, grown-up stuff. And, well, I'm getting attacked by more Pokemon right here. And I'm pretty darn sure that I should be looking for something. Probably that Frost Stone or something. And I've already been there. Okay, so... Okay. Alrighty. So, what was, what was I saying? Decision... Yes, the decision into pausing Pokemon Moon. Obviously, my schedule has picked up quite a bit again. And, you know, I just need to make sure that I have everything in order. I've already uh, made a lot of progress on both Pokemon Brown and in Pokemon... Um, in this Pokemon version too, and I feel as though that I can get these games done quicker before I can go into Pokemon Moon because as I, if I remember correctly, Pokemon Moon has a lot of a lot of content that I need to I need to finish up, and it's gonna need a lot of my attention. So that's where everything's coming from, guys. I mean, I promise you, last week I tried I tried my hardest to to come out with like an announcement video, but I just I couldn't do it. I needed to do something, but I was just looking at a blank, uh, like a, a blank, uh, screen right here. Not really a blank screen, but just a picture of my avatar and whatnot. And, well, it looks like to me, I think I know what we're doing right here. And, wow, all three of these pseudo-legendary Pokemon right here. I think I already caught an Electabuzz, but, wow, they really put, they really put some pretty good Pokemon in here. Let's see, execute. Anywho, yeah, so, let's see. Uh-oh. Okay. What is this? And... Okay, hold on. Before I, I keep on talking, I got 42 steps. Uh... Jeeps. Okay. This is gonna be... Uh, let's see. Full restore? Nope. Yeah, this is a... <laughs> yeah, this is quite a pickle right here. Uh... Shoots. Uh, you know what? Let's go ahead and toss the... Go ahead and toss the super potion for right now. And let's see, what is this? We found ourselves a metal coat. And what does this sign say right here? Doesn't say anything. Okay. Uh, it looks like we're going to go back into this place again. But let's see, we got a Leafeon turned into a Glaceon. I wonder why. It's probably the stones. And there's well dug into the park. But who by who? Or what? Huh. And if you talk to this guy, there's a lot of. Lots to be found here, but don't run out of steps. Yeah, that is true. So goddamn true. And it looks like I'm going to run out of steps, but we will be going back in here, guys. I kind of have a feeling that we're going to... Yeah, I kind of have a feeling that we're going to go back and... And we're going to have to find something very important in here. So, give me just a sec. I'm going to 
you know, sell some stuff, deposit some stuff. That way we can make some more room for more items in here. So I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, guys. So here we are back into the Safari Zone or whatever they call this place. And we're gonna... Oh, crud. We probably should have... Yeah, we probably should have used some repels right here or something like that. I don't know. But anywho, um... Let's see. Keep on forgetting what I'm trying to say. Oh, look at that. We got ourselves a new arena. Ain't that great. Okay, so we've already caught one. Holy crud. Okay, never mind. Uh, let's see. What is it that I was saying right here? Um... Shoot. Decisions, decisions, decisions. Uh, I guess you could say that I got a little lazy when it came to recording my Pokemon Moon walkthrough. I... I remember recording the first 11 episodes in a week. This is when I was taking Mondays off from work. And I guess once I started taking the weekends off and incorporating Mondays back, it, it just became a little tougher. I don't know why. Um, actually, I, I, it felt like I had a lot more to, uh, a lot more to do uh, during the weekdays when I included Monday. And it was... And it literally took like about maybe two weeks for my schedule to just like adjust, like for it to like you know a actually allow me to have a proper weekend off and whatnot. Uh, and well, like right now, I'm actually recording all my weekend off. I'm I'm, a I'm actually happy that I have weekends off now because, damn, you don't know how you don't know how it, uh, you don't know how how tough it is to work. What was it? Four or five years uh, straight every single day uh, this is because you know of course I am a you know private uh, well independent uh, gym owner uh, independent contractor all that crud guys and you know sometimes you get to make your own schedule but sometimes the worker in you just you know it works and trainer tips Pokemon hide in tall grass zigzag through the grass areas to flush them out oh, like that Wow, we're, we're just gonna be finding a lot of like the buzzes right here uh, so yeah, we're, I, I've been doing that, guys, for the last four or five years, and it got to a point right here where, you know, it, it just got tiresome. Uh, Monday's off, great, and here we go, area two. For me, Monday's off was great, but then, at, like, you know, when, once I started doing Monday's off, I started to realize that, you know, Monday's, like, I, I don't... I, I just don't need one day, like, my schedule doesn't need one day, it needs two days to, uh, actually have a day off or two, or, you know, you know what I mean, guys. Uh, actually, hold on, I need to go up here. Let's see, what, what do we have right here? Looking for the items, and crap, we're back where we were. Never mind, I think. I don't know, I'm, I'm so lost right here, guys. This is the first time going into this place, and I know me running is just, like, lowering the amount of steps that I have. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, I was here before. Yeah. Huh. Okay, alrighty. So let's just go ahead and get out of here. So yeah, like I was saying, guys, it, it just it was very tough on me, and I've gotten to the point where now it's it's more of like I I I truly like I truly cherish the days I have off because. You know, you need time to breathe, you need time to think, do other things aside from work and all that. And, wow, I only have like 50 steps, this is ridiculous. Yeah, and, yeah, oh wow. Holy crud, okay, so let's just go back in there and waste these steps. You know what, I'm probably just going to buy repels because this is getting way out of hand right here with all these Pokemon attacking me. Yeah, that's probably gonna that's probably gonna be the idea and huh. Okay, so that nullify oh wow, this is new. Okay, so I guess this nullifies the the steps that you have to take. And I do not know where we're at, guys. I really don't. And wow, look at that. Geodude level 32. Okay. So yeah, guys. Um just taking days off now make like it just makes me oh wow okay so I'm starting to I'm starting to get the idea what, what this is all about right here so let's just go ahead and spend some more money and crap baskets on a crapsicle stick yeah there we go propels so yeah like I was saying guys I, I'm, I'm 
I'm, you know, I'm, I'm, uh, you know, enjoying the days off. I'm appreciating, appreciating them a little bit more because I'm actually doing a lot more. Uh, when it comes to walkthroughs and all that stuff, I'm doing the best I can to actually produce as much as I can. Uh, this is why I'm pausing Pokemon Moon because I found a few hack games that I, I know I can complete within a, a short amount of time. And, you know, th for me, it's like this, guys. It's, uh, you know, I've always done regular games, you know, the Pokemon, the regular Pokemon series and all that stuff. Uh, right here, probably the last six months, I want to say, the last six months of, uh, of the year, I want to actually, like, I want to actually uh, give you guys more hack games to, to watch right here on my channel before, you know, we start, we start going back to the regular games, because as, as of right now, you guys should already know that Pokemon, the new Pokemon remake games are coming out pretty soon in November, and right now, I kind of feel, uh, like, very, like, I feel up to date. If you guys know what I'm talking about and well let's see I'm trying to oh okay so I, I see what this is all about so like I was saying guys I feel up to date with hold on just a sec huh uh, no Jesus criminy man I, I, I don't catch a break okay so let's see I guess we're just gonna have to battle and then just save it for ne the next episode. Um, so yeah, like, uh, let's see. Like I was saying, uh, I feel up to date with everything that I'm doing right now, guys. I really am. Uh, there was a point in time where I actually, hold on, what is sound? Yeah, there was a point in time where I was stuck in the same place and I was not progressing in my in my walkthroughs. I was stuck in the same Kanto region, this and that, because uh, you know, out of uh, a habit. But since the uh, the pandemic had started and all that stuff, it gave me more liberty to do a whole bunch of games. Uh, I've completed a boatload of walkthroughs within one year, and hell, we've even gotten done with Pokemon um, Pokemon uh, Sword and Shield. And, yeah, right now I kind of feel like, well, shoot, what's next? I, I know we have to do Pokemon Sun or Sun and Moon. Uh, might as well just wait until the new the new, uh, the new new games come out because, oh, uh, I kind of, like, as, like, we already know. If you're a Pokemon veteran, you, already, you know where to maneuver yourself on all this. And how is that? What the heck? Oh, this guy's going to wreck me. What? what, what hold, hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay. So what type is this guy? And there we go. Wow. I really got to train up my Pokemon now. And, well, let's see. Who is this guy? He's coming out with a Cloyster. Okay. So like I was saying, guys, um, you know, after I, I finished up Pokemon uh, Sun and, or Sword and Shield, I just felt like, okay, so what else is next? I know that I can go play Pokemon uh, Sun and Moon. You know that 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 could take my time and you know, all that stuff, but then you know I got lazy. I got lazy with uh with with making it. So then afterwards it just went through this and all that crud. And right now my heart is where my heart is at hack games right now. Like I kind of want to just showcase hack games because you know it's very tempting. I really wanna I really wanna see what this is all about. You know first time games. A lot of the games that I'm coming out or the uh, that I will co be coming out I'm very familiar with. That's why with the new remake games. I, like, there's the part where we know what we're going to be doing in that game, but then there's the other part that we don't know, and that is what they added on to these remakes. So, I'm looking forward to that, and then I just saw the, I just saw the previews for Pokemon Arceus and all that stuff. That's got me excited as well. So, there are a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff that I want to do, guys, and, well, it's only a matter of time before we actually get to do that stuff. Now... I made the mistake of not bringing the strength technique right here. This is the secret cave. And, well, let's see. Maybe we should get that item right there. Battle that girl, get that item, and then finish off the episode right here. Yeah, okay, whatever. So yeah, guys, that's kind of like my mini explanation to a whole bunch of stuff. I know that I've been going like in a tangent, like just back and forth and all that stuff. Uh, 
you know, this is just an impromptu, for me, it's just an impromptu, uh, you know, explanation to why I decided to, you know, why I decided to take off, uh, or take a pause on Pokemon Moon and all that stuff. Now, there's another thing, too. My schedule, of course, uh, it's a lot. It's a lot that I, I'm, I'm, I'm p picking up right now. It's a lot that I'm picking up. It's a lot that I'm picking up right now, as I was saying, because somebody had to open up my door. Um, but it's a lot of the stuff that I want to do, that I've been waiting on doing, you know. I don't know if we're back on normalcy or anything like that, but, <laughs> you know, we'll see what ends up happening. I mean, so far, everything is going well. Uh, we haven't had any issues. You no know, COVID cases and all that stuff, and, you know, I'm just, you know, for me, like, a lot of people would brace for the worst and all that stuff, and for me, it's just like, you know, whatever happens, happens, and, like, either way, I win some, because, you know, I'm doing the stuff that I like doing, or, you know, it happens, everything gets paused again, and we're all paused, and we can't do the stuff that we, that we're doing, but I'm still doing the things I love, like, YouTube and all that stuff, so I'm still seeing positives in every single one of these things, guys, so, you know, there's always a positive with where the negative is at, so I'm just seeing it from that point of view, and wow, this guy's got a Magnezone, and, uh, wow, okay, so we still got Steel types, and, oh, nearly defeats this guy, and, well, he's coming out with a Hyper Potion, so let's go again with another Flamethrower, and, well, there comes a, a thunder shock. Now I'm still, I'm still curious what, what it, that exe execute was. And wow, Magnezone kicked our butts right there. So let's go straight to Bruce Lee since it is a fighting type, or I think I don't know. Here we go, double kick. And come on. Oh my God! If this person uses another, for oh God. Okay. There we go. Okay. So look at that. We're getting our butts kicked and all that stuff. And Bruce Lee grows to level 36. And, well, yeah, you are furious. Okay, so grabbing ourselves a TM-47. And I want to know what this is all about. Explosion. Okay, so that's another move that I probably won't be using on my Pokemon. And, well, I'm just going to... Yeah, I'm going to waste the... I'm going to waste the... Actually, let's... Yeah. Wow, my Pokemon got wrecked. Alright, so I'm gonna use up the, the steps that I have right here. 140 or 124. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna do that. Yeah, we, we had more than enough steps. It's just that, good God, I think I already... I need to do a little bit of research on this place right here. But like I was saying, guys, it, that's a little bit of an explanation of everything and well going forward i hope that you guys have fun watching my videos as much as i'm you know having fun making them uh geez i don't know what else to, i don't know what else to say it's just you know it's good to be back recording again it's good to have two days off rather than one and uh, well we shall see what happens in the next episode I, i'm gonna do some research on that place see what we, we could actually find and if it's in, if it's if, it, if it's something of importance then i'll you know come back to the next episode but in the meantime i'll see you guys tomorrow for another episode of pokemon brown see you guys